walking Miss Lily. There's always something going on on Grandpa's farm. A place where you're always welcome. Come on, Lily. Let's go feed. Hey, kids. Thought I'd take you along on our morning walk. Ah, Lily and I go for a walk almost every day. Not as often as we probably should, but uh, as often as we can. Anyhow, we're here in the alleyway, you know, behind uh, Johanna's house. These old towns in Ohio, they have all the houses out on the streets, but behind all the houses, <clears throat> they have an alleyway. And that's where all your services, like the garbage man and all that kind of stuff comes through. And everybody seems to park behind their houses, using the alleyways as access to the garages and stuff. Oh. And you can kind of see the alleyway behind here. Sort of interesting. Hey kids, Grandpa here. I am thrilled to bring out a great healthy product like my own goat milk soap. Designed and manufactured from the safest and finest ingredients I could find, my soaps contain olive oil, palm oil, coconut oil, sweet almond oil, and of course goat's milk. Goat's milk soap will not dry out your skin like many other soaps. This is important in keeping skin naturally moisturized to keep it healthy. Prices and ordering information are in the description down below. Thanks for trying Grandpa's Farms Goat Milk Soaps. Remember, 100% money back guarantee. Some of you guys can see that. Yeah, I guess you can. Nope, no playing in the puddle today. All right. You now she smells something. Oh, a couple of vultures. Oh, they're, they're eating that dead raccoon. Look at that, turkey buzzards. Right there, a couple of vultures. There was a raccoon hit by a car. It's now laying right there in these people's front yard. And the uh, turkey buzzards are cleaning it up. Oh, and I can tell you right now, it does not smell all that great. This is one time when you did not want me to have smell-o-vision. Interesting. <clears throat> All right, very busy street here. Very busy street. Well, we just got to be patient and wait for an opening. Lily's really interested in those big birds over there. She wants to go. Uh, she wants to go get them. But we'll leave them to their business. Oh, we got an opening here. Okay. Whoop, there's more of them. Wow. All right, we got an opening here to get across. This is really heartbreaking to me. I came over here the other day, a whole bunch of shopping carts in the water. I contacted uh, Target, see if they'd come and get their carts back up, send one of their employees over here, but, yeah, damn people. <sighs> Some people, man, I tell you, it's just so disappointing. <clears throat> Going to be some changes coming up on the YouTube channel here pretty soon. Uh, stepping up more, more production, more production, more productivity, more videos coming. Uh, going to make some pretty big changes here coming up pretty soon. I'm going to be uh, starting to look at land in earnest, trying to buy a piece of property. In fact, I started a series right now where I'm uh, talking about how to go ahead and buy property without the use of a realtor. Lily, come. When I first stayed over here with Johannes, I would bring a trash bag with me out on this hike, walk out here and pick up garbage. And it was just crazy. I'd pick up a bunch of garbage. The next day, there'd be another bunch of garbage. The next day, another bunch of garbage. Never, never an end to it.
All right. I'm going to turn around here for today. You know, at my age, I'm just not going to push myself that hard. I'm going to go on these little short walks. I'll walk further than I did last yesterday, and that's all that matters. Tomorrow, I'll go further than I did today. Every day, add a little distance, add a little distance. Let it build up without killing myself. Without hurting myself. I see this open packaging back here all the time. I have to wonder to myself how much of this is stuff stolen from the stores over in the shopping mall. People pocket something, come back over here, take it out of the packaging, dump the packaging on the ground. Pretty disappointing people, pretty disappointing. Whew. Getting warm today really warmed up considerably. <clears throat> a good breeze blowing out here. That bag bothered you, isn't it, huh? We'll pick it up. Go get it. That bag's rolling about the same speed I'm walking. I'm not catching up to it. It'll probably roll all the way to the road. Now yeah, we'll get it. There we go. There it hung up. Oh, what are you going to do? You're going to get the bag? If you've been watching the thing roll all this time, and now all of a sudden you're upset by it? You goofy ass dog. Now she's cooling off in the puddle. Today was garbage day. That's why everyone's garbage cans are out by the uh, uh, alley here. Normally people have them put back up by their houses. But today was garbage day. Ooh. Huh. All right. Well, how about them toad suckers? Ain't they sappy? Sucking them toads all sure make them happy. Hug a mug of toad suckers way down south. Sticking them sucky toads in their mouth. I be a toad sucker knowing to duck it. You just find an old toad and you rear back and suck it. Folks, you have a good day. Bye.